I did not have my microphone down. I'm so fucking stupid. Uh, Fitz go this time, eh? You almost go around the world. Very well, are you ready? All aboard. So if you didn't hear me when I was saying it earlier, we were under tornado watch. Yeah, so that's why this is a little late. I figured we could get an hour, hour and a half in. Go see Eileen. She's in charge of the Fitzcull region. We should be able to see her if we go to the Rembrandt Mansion. We only really get to use this boat that way. Have a save point here. fighting was giving me enough experience, so I just decided to move on. This look is so soft to the touch. I like shorts. They're comfy. They're easy to wear. Get out of my way. My rich young boy is shopping at the harbor all by his lonesome. He looks like a servant. <laughs> no, sis, he's an orphan, and he's certainly not rich. Mother told me that these kids had no parents and they were adopted by a rich woman. No wonder they're different from us. You and your sister aren't fashionable like us. Your sister is working every day covered with dirt. She's so dirty, ick. Yeah, no, the uh, walker said that that area is a little bit tough. I think it's just a one-time thing, though. You're going home by the lower road. Your friends are there, aren't they? There are so many children without parents hanging around. I'm afraid to go there. The town looks gloomy when there are poor people around. I hate it. That's more than enough. What? Who are you? Are you telling us what to do? You're not doing. We're not doing anything wrong. Yeah, we're not doing anything wrong. Why can't we tell poor people that they're poor? It's the truth. Ugh, that's why I hate spoiled rich kids like you. What? How dare you talk to us like that? Oh, but you can talk to people however you want. Our papa is a respected man in this town. So what? What's your point? How? Why are you yelling at us? We'll get you for this. You should go back to your sister. Thanks. You're very kind. I'm just doing what I think is right. Come on, let's get moving. Please refrain from smoking, eating, drinking, or staff. I know she was no shirt no service. They don't know why that's a big deal in a weapons store, but okay. Hmm. Get a maze for her. Better shields and helmets. Gunlets. I'll give that to Mary then.
Parasaurian. That's cute. I want this warrior's helmet. What would you do with it? You're a normie. You don't fight. Why, Leon, what are you doing here? I heard your cargo ships are being attacked. Yes, we've been having problems with that lately. I have a good plan to deal with this. Would you like to be part of it? A good plan? Well, come on in. I'll listen to what you have to say inside. Can you excuse us? Yes, no problem. This way, please. I don't think I've introduced myself. I'm Eileen Wimbrandt. I'm the general manager of the Fitzgerald branch. And those folks? They are Stellan, Rute, Philia, and Mary. How do you do? I'm Stellan Oliver. I'm Rute. My name is Philia Felice. I'm Mary. Nice to meet you, Eileen. It's a pleasure to meet you all. So, Leon, tell me about your plan. We'll be a decoy to draw out the pirates. When they come, we'll come along. You make it sound so easy. They're very organized and good at what they do. We've lost a lot of shipments this month already. All we have to do is catch their leader. Once we find out where they're from, we can do lots of things. The risk is too high. You don't trust me? I didn't say that. Besides, these fools here are useful as well. Fools? Useful? What do you mean by that? Well, I guess there's nothing to lose. Alright, uh, no other ones. But please, don't do anything rash. Remember, I'm the one who'll be disciplined by Huda. Don't make any mistakes, do you understand me? Yeah, I do. You get my house as you like until your departure. I'll get the ship ready. Please look for me at the harbor in a little while. Cool, we get to fight some pirates. Elvain. That's a herb.
miss you my first time. Rune bottle, I think that is. What does that do again? Follow the unsworth from now. Follow this kid? Hey! Do you want to say that? He is too young? Pardon me, but we should select someone with more experience to be in charge here. By saying that, you're implying that I'm only a helpless little woman, too. No, 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 I didn't mean to. Haha, <laughs> I was just kidding. But don't worry, this is being done under Hugo's rules. President Hugo. I understand. Then he's in charge now. Well, yeah, good luck. Won't disappoint you. I know you. Let's set sail right away. Aye, sir. Fine, marry you go next. Okay. Ah, I wish they would just get it over with and attack us right now. This is the strangest thing I've heard. You want us to be attacked? Oh, give me a break. I think I know what you mean. Hey, Stan, you better not let's start saying weird things, too. Remember, it's our strategy to let them attack us and get all of them with one swift blow. Oh, yeah, you're right. This strategy might turn out to be a mistake. What? What do you mean by that? I mean, they're not stupid. They might have recognized that this is a trap. What's going on? The enemy is here. I guess they're stupid after all. Are you being sarcastic? Not really. Well, let's go. Okay, who do you want to bring in? Going up against pirates, so I'm not too worried about using magic. Alright, we'll place Philly in then. Get all of our arms, get all our arms men up. Ready. We sack and get the leader of each ship so we can come near their vehicles. Their only hope. Vessels, no vehicles, whatever. What's up, buddy?
Fight just pulls out a fish and throws it at someone as an attack. Never seen that tech before. Yeah, that'll kill your face kit. Your face kit marks. Okay. Okay. Bring it.
Come on, guys. I'm just trying to loot your stuff. I'm not here to kill you. I just want to kill your leader. Take me to your leader. Now. Fuck you.
cast that spell with just one guy, Rute. Ruby. Rute. Rute. Which one is it? I keep calling Rute, but it's, should it actually be Rute?
have at it. Mostly avoiding combat just to save time. That's a lucky amount of change to find. Here we go. Sea Breeze. Not really right out the door, come on.
seem to lose that enough. Oh, that can cast rather quickly. Nice. Look how his corpse is charred. Nice. This next guy. Damn it. Ha! 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 Ha!
Oh yeah, it is. Sweet. And they had me cornered pretty good. If anything, we ganged up on them.
Okay, I guess there's a spot there I can't move past against the wall. Okay, let's see what our spell is. Very alright. So our thief is our healer and defense. Looking for money to pose with us. Priorities, I guess. Okay, 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 hold on. No idea where I'm going anymore. An hourglass. Best kind of figure. Mm -hmm. Now, this is definitely the captain's quarters. Batista? Filio? Who is this? He's a priest who used to work with me. I didn't think you would come after me. You should have remained as a statue. Batista, where is Lida? I'll tell you if you win this fight. You're the only one left. This is your last chance to surrender peacefully. Who do you think you are? You don't know the gravity of your own situation. Boss music, alright. Caster to either side of him, two warriors to back him up. Alright. <laughs> Oh my god! Wow, that's some fucking priest! Sing in there, Mary! And there's no item timer in this game. That's nice.
better position. But he's just blinking. Oh shit. about wasting anything. Damn it! Now tell us where Lydon is. Lydon? Who? I don't have a clue. What? You promised you would tell us. You were so naive. Promises are made to be broken. I know how to deal with scum like you. I have my methods. I'll interrogate you thoroughly when we get back to shore. You've been for don't threaten me, you little punk. You'll be sorry for your lack of respect. I don't think respect is the issue here. Leon! Eileen! Meet the leader of the pirates. All of you have done well. I don't know how to thank you. Free stuff. It's no big deal. Eileen, we have to use one of your rooms. That's fine, boy. Four. I'm interrogating this scum. I need it. I need him to give us information. I'll go ahead to Eileen's house. Don't waste your time sightseeing. Come straight to her house. Okay, okay. Hey, walk straight. Okay, all right. Let's go. Sure. stock our stuff. Okay, so I have a food stack, but how does that help me? I don't get it. that on the shelf for people to buy? I guess people need... I guess people need to eat. What was the last one? Mango steam. Okay. Probably? 
Let's get me straight to cutscene. I want to go shopping. Alright. You're wasting your time. I don't know anything. We'll find out soon enough if you really don't know a thing. He knew that Philia was petrified, so he had to have been there, right? Mary, come here. What is it, Leon? Don't move. Are you taking this pretty tiara off me, Leon? Hey, why are you taking Mary's off? Take mine off, too. One is enough. Besides, I don't trust you enough to behave on your own. What? I've been a good girl. I haven't done anything bad. You're interfering with my interrogation. No sightseeing or something. Why, you little snot-nosed brat. Yeah! Damn it, shut up. What did you put on my head? Same thing that stupid woman has. What's his problem? I can't take this off anymore. Hey, where are you going? I'll be sleeping in my room. Wake me up if Batista says anything. Hey, Barry, you come too. Okay. Hey. What are you gonna do, Stun? Well, I don't know. Are you free, Stun? What? Well, now you mentioned it, sort of. Would you like to go out on a date with me? Uh, uh d d date? Date with you, or...? I mean, I can imagine Stun's a type to like older woman. But how old is she supposed to be? I'd imagine, like, the 40s at the most. White, but I could just be, you know, anime white. Or else it's supposed to be black like Leon's hair. Haha, <laughs> look at you, you're blushing. You're so cute. I was just kidding. But what? I was kidding about the day part, but I'll give you a tour of the town. Or you don't want to go out with a wolf or woman. Do it, dude! Do it, dude! She's know what she's doing! She'll be crazy! Uh oh, that's not it. Yeah, sure, I'll take you up on your offer. Okay, then let's go. You wanna come with us, Philia? No, I'll stay here. I'm worried about something, and I can't get out of my mind right now. Alright then, try to get some rest, and don't worry about things that are beyond your control. Thanks for your advice, I'll be fine. Okay, Philia, I'll see you later. Yes, enjoy yourselves. Going out with that older woman, I can't stand it! Hey, Mary, we're gonna follow them. Rootie, aren't you gonna sleep? No, just shut up and follow me. Okay, Rootie, don't get so upset. This would be a good session to play as her. Stan, where are you from? I'm from a village called Lania, in Fitzgeld. So you're from here? I thought you were from another country since you were with Leon. But Lania is a country village, and I've never been to a city like this. Oh, is this your first visit to... New Estad? Yes, it is. I'm good. I can show you around it. Shall we go? This is New Itstad Central Park. His cherry blossoms are in full bloom right now. His cherry shoes were also in full blossom when I first came here. Ah, so you're not from Fitzgeld? No, I used to live in Sunningel with my father. Are you disappointed? No, I didn't mean that. I have this town now, but I really hated it when I first came here. When I felt bad, I came to this park and spent a lot of time looking at these cherry blossoms. Cherry blossoms are the same in Sign of Galdor and Newstock, or anywhere else. That's when I realized that I was letting silly things bother me. I realized that living in another country didn't really matter. That's when I knew I could face anything. I see. Shall we walk by the ocean? Oh, that's a little romantic. Here is the best view you can get in Newitstock. You can see the islands in the distance on a clear day. The waves are a little high today, though. Looks like you could swim here if it was a little warmer. Huh. <sighs> Something wrong? I can't swim. I can't swim. No, but it's okay because I don't like to get my hair wet. Besides, I've been so busy dealing with other things in my life that I never got around to learning how. 
Oh, that's too bad. Really feels great to swim in a pond or pool. I don't understand the concept of not being able to swim. I can understand not practicing it, but like, how do you not know to just kick your arms and legs to keep your head above the water? I don't get that. Oh yeah, I can teach you how to swim if you want. Okay, I'll think about your offer. Shall we go? Ugh. Tired all of a sudden. You're a tourist. Long time ago, Fitzgull was once a wasteland that no one dared to inhabit. However, Sinengeld's Kingdom Public Works initiative to exploit natural resources in this area brought the prosperity that you see before you today. Fitzgeld certainly was reborn as a prosperous country. But this country lost something important along the way. I wonder if you can place what price on what was lost. What? I'm sorry. I guess I'm tired from too much work. Are you alright? Stan, you're so sweet. I'm just worried about you. Ah, he's turning red. Thank you, I'm fine, don't worry. Yes, the dumbass selfless hero, the best type. Oh yeah, Stan, shall we go get some softy creeps? Softy creep? What? You don't like them? It's not what I meant, I've never had one. Okay, let's get some. New experiences are important. <sighs> Stan, they sell cool treats here. Sounds fantastic. You know, it's so refreshing to be with someone who's so good and honest like you, Stan. Good and honest? Oh, come on, that's a joke, right? No, I think you really are. And humble, too. <laughs> they just not notice Mary altogether? Two softy creeps, please. Show me a hundred gal. Here you go. Thanks. Hey, I'll pay half. No, don't worry. I'm the one who asked you to go on a date with me. Oh, but... Stan. Yes? There are times when you should let a woman take care of you, okay? Yes. I'm glad you understand. Here, try it. Thanks. If your softer cream has some letters on the stick, you can win. Like this? Oh, Stan, you won. Really? Cool. I get the soft cream vendor and they'll give you another one. And I don't want one right now. There's no expiration, so you can get one anytime you like. Let's see, shall we go to the arena? Yeah, I already bought tickets. Why would you sit in the middle of flower bed to eat your ice cream? Who does that? Tickets, please. Okay, let me 200 gal. Thanks. Let's go in. <laughs> Welcome to the Newt's Dot Arena, where the strength and will of real men are put to the ultimate test. Please present your tickets. Thank you. Enjoy. We're inside the arena. Should we go in the spectator seats? Better be one of the cool arenas where they actually fight to the death. Yeah, it's assuming it's man on man combat, not man versus beast. Give me a worthy challenger! That's the champion, Bruiser King. He's a monster who doesn't know the word lose. He hasn't lost in years. Yep. I'm gonna say he's gonna be the monk of the party. Sure looks tough. I'll show you the waiting room. Follow me. Here is audience members, they're just gonna let us in. Unless Eileen himself has some connections. 
most likely should be level 30 by now. No, I'm like level 18. Hey, we have a surprise contestant. The next challenger is a woman. Looks like the challenger is Miss Eileen of the Rembrandt family. Unfortunately, I'll pass. Hey, babe, come on now. We're just visiting today. Hey, you with the pointy head in the back. You want to fight? Pointy head? I see. The real challenger is Miss Eileen's friend. Stalin, don't listen to them. What's the matter with you, little boy? Hiding behind a woman's back? How can you call yourself a real man? But what did you say? Stalin. First of all, I don't like the fact that a woman entered our holy arena. What did you say, you pig? What's going on? It looks like they're arguing. Ooh, I'm so scared. Is there a woman? Don't turn me on. Well. Anyway. Anyone who's not willing to fight is trash. Trash should be thrown out of here into the dumpster. Goodbye, pointy head. You're a sissy. How dare you say those things to our faces? I don't know if you're some kind of politician or what, but you're really beginning to get on my nerves. If you calm down a bit more, I'll let you be my girlfriend. <laughs> oh, I've had enough of you. I'll take you on. Stan, don't. Don't get hurt. I said things you shouldn't have. I can't tolerate trash talking scumbags like this. What did you call me? Scumbag? Who's the scumbag? Well, now let's take a look around. Now I see one right here, and he's this Baldy standing in front of me. Baldy! I'm not gonna let this bozo beat me. Watch me teach him a lesson. I'll beat you to a bloody pulp, it'll only take three seconds. Now it looks like things are settled. Now we're going to have a special match. Our champion, Kang, versus Mr. Pointyhead. Who's the Pointyhead? Let's get ready to rumble! Wow, they actually inserted that. They have fun with dialogue sometimes in Tales games. Probably not the best idea, but... Okay, do I have to win this fight? Right, I'm just gonna save state just in case. Really should have given me some kind of warning. Right, well, I'm gonna try to win. Yeah, I guess it should be possible, but only like on a new game plus. It's done! The winner is Bruiser K. The pointy head is lost. I expected more from Mr. Big Mouth here. Come back if you dare. Yeah, because there's no way they're going to place me in a fight I would get a game over losing without warning like that. I'm telling you the whole time I need to level up. I'm leveling up at the rate that the game is letting me level up at, dude. Calm down. I don't want to get over up. Ugh. Oh, where am I? You regained consciousness. Oh, yeah, I was at the arena. Champion wants to say something to you. Can you get up? Yeah, I'm alright. Well, uh, I'm terribly sorry about what happened. Now this is the kind of game where you need to overlevel. Alright, well, I'll give it a try then. What? You're a promising young man. I'm sorry there will come a time when we will fight again. When that time comes, I'll beat you to a bloody pulp. Mark my words. Get out of my way. What was that about? I guess it's his peculiar. I guess it's his peculiar way of expressing his friendship to you. Shall we get going? Yeah, I'm definitely filling a friendship with my three broken ribs. Stan, you were trying to protect me, weren't you? Thank you. Well, uh, not really. You made me very happy. I just couldn't forgive the things you said. And I like people who have strong convictions. Shall we go? If you do beat him, he offers to join your party. Okay.
save that for a new game plus. I had fun today. I hope you'll ask me out next time. What? Come on, let's go. Welcome back, Scott. Philia, how's it going? Do we have any information yet? No, nothing yet. Ah! Do you feel like talking now? We want information. I... I don't know. Ugh. Oh, spare us your heroics. All we want is information. By hook or by crook, we'll get it. How am I supposed to tell you things that I don't know about? Ah! Information. We want information. You'll die soon if you don't tell me. I don't know a thing! Ah! Tough not to crack that one. Leon! Don't mind the mess, he just passed out. He probably pissed himself too, Jesus. He still has some valid me, so I'm not about to kill him quite yet. But this is... This is for today, at least. But I don't think he'll give us that information even if we continue with the interrogation. Let's go, Philia. Philia? What? Oh, yes. Are you gonna tie him up or something? Lock the door? Philia, what are you doing around here at this late hour? Oh, Batista. I needed to research something. No need for a new game plus. Yeah, sounds like that's the case. I just have to go back to the arena to fight him. Like, research something? For the Archbishop? Yes, yeah, sort of. Sort of. All this secret cloak and dagger nonsense is the reason why he gets stressed out and gets sick. This has to be done by tomorrow. I really have no choice. Alright, you're helpless by yourself, so I'll help you. Batista, you're so kind. <laughs> Knock it off, I'm not kind. Go on and do your research. Yes. Damn it, that kid is merciless. This. My good looks are ruined. I'll take this damn thing off my head. Ah! <laughs> How cute. I get an electric truck if I try to take the damn thing off. That ah, well, life. Huh? Hey, I forgot to lock this. Oh my god, Leon, you fucking. But one thing! All the people that make that mistake, it should not be fucking Leon. Dude is proven as hell. Good morning, Philia. You're up early. No, it's Don. Can you come with me? Where? I'm taking something to eat to Batista. He'll die if the questioning continues like this. Philia, sure, I'll go with you. Here, let me carry the tray for you. Thank you. I thought Stone wasn't much of a morning person. Batista, yeah. brought you some food. Huh? It's not here. Oh no. Hey, hey! Batista escaped! What? He escaped? How? I, I don't know. Philia, you didn't. What? You didn't let him go because of your past relationship with him at the temple, did you? No, I didn't do anything. Stop it, Routine. You don't know that. Well, now, Stun. I know that you're really on Philia's side. Whatever the case, we need to make some things black and white in this world. What's with this racket so early in the morning? Listen up. Batista escaped, and... Oh, that. I let him go on purpose. What the f... Okay. I'll hear you out. What? You... Are you insane? Why did you let our only clue to find the Eye of Adamani go? Calm down, you idiots. Why do you think I put the tiara on his head? Ah. That tiara has a homing beacon built into- Oh, I see what you're doing. Okay. I can find out where he is by using my proximity detector. So you're going to let him lead us to where Lidon is? Exactly. Okay. Good one. Have you going there for a second. Philia, I'm sorry. I jumped to conclusions. Mary, let's go. Ruti, you made a false accusation. Ah, uh, shut up, will ya? 
Come on, let's go. Well, we should go after him. Stan, it's my fault. When I was doing something that made Ruti suspicious of me. What are you saying? That's not true. As Ruti admitted, she jumped to conclusions. It's okay. I'm too naive. You're not naive. I think you're a kind person. In fact, you are who you are because of your kindness. But it'll be a big loss for us if you leave us now. We're all working together. It's done. Hey, don't worry about it anymore. Everybody's waiting for us. Yes. Where is Eileen? I believe Miss Eileen is at the harbor. The harbor. It'll be convenient for us to ask for a ship. You're late. Sorry. Eileen is at the harbor. Let's go. First, we can buy the freaking items I want. Where's the store? Mary's just goofing around during the cutscenes. That's nice. 
I'm on a secret mission from the King of Sign and Gout. You have to recover the Eye of Adamani from them. Please, we need your help. I can only take you there. But it'll be a one-way trip. I can't bring you back from there. Is that alright? That's fine. We're ready. Please take us. Okay. I understand. Captain, get the ship ready for departure. Yes, madam. Thank you. I owe a debt to you. Don't worry about it. Oh, I forgot. 
probably the only woman works in this town. People say that it's not good for women to work, but I enjoy it. Oh, I got a pool table. Sweet. Hey, drink up. Why is there... Why is this man pouring me a drink? Social drinker, I guess? It's easy to drink too much when you're having fun. I should cut back on the hard stuff. Okay, all right. When you're all night, you want to stay? I say, look them again sometime. Well then, I guess we have to look around to find leads of where to, what to do next. It looks like we have to investigate Moreau. Hmm. Okay, well, that's it when I call it a night here. I'm starting to yawn, so. You know, the usual deal. Follow me on YouTube, Twitch, Twitter, blah, 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 blah. Follow me. I'm so close to getting 50 followers, so that's going to be awesome. Safety and peace out, everyone.